seven no-hit innings from Jackson Hickert. Antonio Frias activated today. Did not allow a hit in the eighth. And now it is Dylan Stutzman as we head to the ninth from Wintrust Field. The Schaumburg Boomers have never thrown a no-hitter. This is the 11th season of Schaumburg Boomers baseball. And Dylan Stutzman will try to preserve the no-hitter with Ray Zuberer leading off. And the first pitch fastball is high, 1-0. There has been a no-hitter here at Wintrust Field, but it was against the Boomers, the 1-0. Slider drops in, strike one. Chris Roycroft, Austin Shea, Brett Smith, Brad Van Aslin, and Trevor Sharpie combined on a no-hitter for Joliet on July 22nd of the 2021 season. Line drive right side, foul into the Schaumburg bullpen. Woo! Exhale. Zuber is 0 for 2 with a walk, and he'll need a new stick. Two runs, six hits, and no errors for Schaumburg. 0-0-2 oh, oh, on the board for Florence. Ninth inning. Dylan Stutzman looking to finish it off. The righty is out for the ninth time. No record. ERA at .96. He's one out of one in the save department. Four walks and 13 strikeouts. One and two on Zuberer who is taking a sweet time returning to the left-handed batter's box. Stutzman deals. And a pop to the left side and out of play. Boomers have issued seven walks in the game. But no hits. Another one-two pitch. High fly ball in the air to right center. Simington and Milazzo converge. It'll be Milazzo to make the catch. Shy of the warning track. Schomburg is two outs away. Brian Fuentes steps in with one out in the ninth. And the Boomers leading two to nothing. There have been plenty of combined no-hitters in the Frontier League. As I mentioned, the last of those was right here at Wintrust Field in 2021. First pitch to Fuentes. He takes a strike, 0-1. Fuentes 0 for 3 with a strikeout. Here's the 0-1 from Stutzman. Just off the plate away. A couple of sliders to start the at-bat. Here's the 1-1. Popped up. Into shallow right, Simington spots it. He'll come in, reach up, and make the catch. Two outs. Get on your feet, Wintrust Field. Come on. Jeremiah Burks represents the last hopes for Florence. First pitch from Stutzman. Slider just outside, 1-0. Burks is 0 for 2 with a walk. And time is called by the Florence shortstop. Two outs, ninth inning. 2 0 Schomburg. No hits for Florence. The 1 0. Front door with a slider. 1 and 1. Hoping for a chance in the on deck circle is Marcos Castillo. Stutzman's 1 1. Slider away, ball two. Top of the ninth, two outs. Is tonight the night? The 2 1 pitch. Oh, it hits Burks on the hand. Fastball escaped Stutzman. And Burks will trot up the first baseline. The significance of this only being a 2-0 game means that the tying run is coming to the plate here with Burks now on at first. No hits for Florence, but seven walks and now a hit batter. First at bat for Marcos Castillo had two hits and three runs scored yesterday for Florence. First pitch coming. Stutzman fires a fastball inside, 
And Fiorenza steps up, wanting a new baseball. Two outs in the ninth, two nothing Schaumburg. Stutzman, the third pitcher, trying to finish off a combined no hitter. Here's the 1 0. Breaker for a strike, one and one. Selma will hold on Burks at first, and now he backs up behind the runner. Stutzman sets his 1-1. A little bit low as he tried the inner edge. He's been working off the slider, which is pretty typical. And he throws off Eric Krupa's signature, says, you know what? I don't like this one. Maybe your next ball is autographed a little better, Mr. League President. Here's the 2-1. A called strike. Runner takes off for second. Throw one hops behind the bag. It is a steal for Burks because of the fact that it is a two-run ball game. But clearly the focus is on the batter, and now the Boomers are a strike away from the first no-hitter in franchise history. The crowd makes some noise here at Wintrust Field. Over 3,000 strong tonight. Two and two on Castillo. Stutzman's ready, and a pitch clock violation makes it a full count. That's the third violation against the Boomers tonight. Three and two the count, the pitch. Outside ball four, it'll bounce past Fiorenza. And a wild pitch allows Burks to head into third base. Now the tying runs are on with two outs. That is the eighth walk surrendered by Schaumburg in the game. And Nick Odo emerges from the dugout. We will have a pinch hitter here for Florence. Zade Richardson is going to bat for Cooper Edwards. The Boomers were a strike away from the first no hitter in franchise history. Nick Odo trying to settle down Dylan Stutzman. Again, it's only a two nothing game. The tying runs are on base for the Yalls. Zade Richardson pinch hitting. He started the first two games of this series. Had a couple of hits yesterday. And Jamie Bennett trying to communicate with the home plate umpire Chad Ozy. They couldn't hear each other over the noise here at Wintrust Field. First and third with two away. Two outs in the ninth. No hits for Florence. Stutzman's first offering. Swing and a miss at a breaker in the dirt. Fiorenza keeps it in front, but scampering into second base is Castillo. And now all of a sudden, the tying runs are in scoring position on another wild pitch. We could go from no hitter to tie game in the blink of an eye here in the ninth. Second and third with two away. Stutzman's ready. His 0-1. High fly ball to the right side, out of play, and for the second consecutive batter, the Boomers are a strike away from the first no-hitter in franchise history. Coop down in the tunnel trying to fire up the fans. Stutzman looking to finish off a combined no-no. His 0-2 pitch, check swing down and away on a slider. Did he go? No. And the ball game continues for the moment. One more strike, the crowd is chanting. One, two pitch. Swing and a miss, strike three! Stutzman completes the combined no-hitter. The first no-hitter in franchise history. 
a slider away, and the Boomers will celebrate. It took over 10 seasons, but finally, the Boomers have thrown a no-hitter.